today we're unboxing the Valve Index. This is the box that shipped in. Just a simple box here. This is where the Valve Index is. Damn. Damn. Yeah. 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 Got other things pretty basic. Yeah. 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 Da, da, da. Yeah. 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 Wow. This is it. Got this. Oh, what is this? Setup guide. Uh, Setup guide in every single language imaginable. A little microfiber cloth. Safety guide. Shows you how to install. Also, here's Rocky. Damn, here are the controllers. The left one. Do these take batteries? I actually have no idea. Nope. USB C. Wow, look at that. Say if they take batteries, that'd be like. Is this Microsoft? Damn. Oh, is this for. Yeah, it's for that. When it says valve index the inside there. This is one of the cameras. This shit looks very fancy. God damn. A huge HDMI, USB, and then oh this is probably power. Jeez, look at this thing. Oh yeah, it's got the little headphones, which I'm not gonna be using, but I've heard they're actually pretty good. But I've got the Logitech uh, Pro X Wireless. So that will be, that'll be a far superior experience, I'd imagine. Little things to put the cameras on. I don't know where I'm gonna put the cameras, actually. Uh, power adapter in there. It's got to be a cable, I'd imagine, for the cameras. Or is this? Yeah, I think so. Look at that connector on there. It almost looks like. Uh... Oh, this is really squishy. I don't know how to get it to stop focusing on one spot, but... Wow, this is really squishy. <laughs> um, so I guess this probably just goes back here, if your head is really small. My guess. Let's see what this is. Power adapter. So I think these are the power adapters for the cameras. You put two of them. This looks like it's something for the headset. Oh wow, another power adapter for the headset. Jeez. 
another cable for the headset or for the cameras and then this is oh is this the charging cable for the controllers oh yeah nice comes with two usb c's one for each controller all right well i think that's pretty much it not a ton here i'll have a video when it's all set up or i'll resume when it's all set up <laughs> all right this is a day later i forgot to i got too distracted didn't continue the video so i've used it for a bit now it's pretty nice not gonna lie these speakers actually work really well it's kind of shitty though because you have to if you want to use a headset you have to uh, unscrew them. You have to use the Torx to take them out. So I figured I'll just try them. And they actually, they work pretty good. I guess the benefit to having these is that when you're moving around gaming, like that would probably, that would probably just fall off my head. But the good thing with this is that they're attached. So there's nothing like that gonna happen. Here's the camera. I just have them set up. It says it wants you to have them set up, one in front and one behind. So that's what I've done, it's super easy. Literally, you just have to plug them into the wall. And then the Steam thing, uh, the VR app pops up and you just calibrate it. it. Takes like a few minutes. The remotes were good. Um, they can take some abuse. I've smacked them into the wall. A few times, let's see. Rip. Yeah, this one's been abused quite a bit. <laughs> Smacking it up here. Taking the paint off. Because uh, it gets really small up there and it's hard to tell where I am. But yeah, I would recommend getting it if you're if you want a VR headset. Definitely worth the money in my opinion.